Hi guys, welcome to our channel. Do you have challenges with integrating Auto IPTV panel into your WordPress selling website? If so, please watch this video to the end. This video will show you how to integrate your selling website with Auto IPTV panel. There are five steps which include how to integrate webhook into WordPress, auto panel setting, add server, auto panel setting, add an email template, WordPress product attribution variation setting, wait for approval. We want more people to benefit from our videos, so take a few seconds to subscribe to our channel, like and share this video. Contact us if you have questions. Boom! 1. How to integrate webhook into WordPress. Let's get started. To send order information from your WordPress to Auto IPTV panel, follow the steps below. Go to your WordPress admin page, go to WooCommerce, on the drop-down, select Settings. Move the cursor up, click Advance. Locate Webhooks. Click Add Webhook. On the fields displayed, input the following. Name, Order Updated. Status, Active. Topic, Order Updated. Delivery URL, AutoIPTVPanel.com slash API slash Order Updated slash. Secret, Empty Value will set a random secret. This alphanumeric key is required when you add a server on auto panel setting. Keep this secret value safe. API version, WP REST API integration version 3. Check whether the information you have entered is correct. If yes, click Save Webhook. WordPress must send Webhook immediately in synchronized mode to prevent order processing delay. For that reason, return to your WP menu, click Appearance, select Theme Editor, Wait as the system redirects you to a new window. Move the cursor to Theme Files. Tap functions.php. Notice the codes? Copy and paste this code. Find the code in the video description or contact admin. Click Update File. File editing is successful. This way, WordPress can send webhook without delay. 2. Auto Panel Setting – Add Server after integrating Webhook to WordPress, you must register your server info on Auto IPTV panel. This step is required to accept webhooks coming from your WordPress. First, contact admin on the Telegram group for approval. Have you got permission? If yes, follow these steps to register your server info. On the left sidebar, go to Settings slash Servers. Click the plus icon to add your reseller info per brand name. Input all the fields. Server name. This should be the same as your product name on WordPress. In this tutorial, it will be Solver Host. Server Prefix, Solver Host. Enter your brand name and it will be added to the delivery email. Panel Name, Domain, .xyz .25500. Put your IPTV panel URL. Username, Solver Host. Input your IPTV panel username. Password, Input your IPTV panel password. Reseller ID, 78. Keep it blank if you don't know your reseller ID. Admin will find this value and fill in the review step. Server type, keep it by default. Admin will set this value in the review step. Package, this value varies on your panel version. Keep it by default. Admin will set this value in the review step. Tick the boxes per your requirement. Auto, enable this field as you will use the auto function. Captcha. If your panel has a CAPTCHA when login, enable this field. Username as email. This is the selection for the account naming rule on your IPTV panel. For now, we have two options. First, create an account username the same as the email address. Second, create an account with the first part of your email. Here is an example. When the customer's email is testuser at gmail.com. First option. Testuser at gmail.com will be the streaming account username. Second option, Testuser will be the account username. If you want some other naming rules, contact admin. Has admin. If you own an IPTV panel, enable this field. Enabled. Enable this field if you want to hide this server, change it to disabled. Review email login details. Your email login is required for sending delivery emails under your email. Replied emails from customers will go into your mailbox. Cell URL. Insert your WordPress website domain name. Example, solverhost.com. Cell customer key. Cell customer secret. Keep them as blank. 
Sell Webhook Secret Get the webhook secret value generated from the first step. If you didn't save, go to WordPress webhook settings again, find the order updated webhook you created, and click edit. You will get this webhook secret value there, then copy and paste it to this field. To confirm the webhook secret, go to the servers. On the server panel, scroll to the right. Copy the cell webhook secret. Check admin approval, not approved if X. Finally, click add server button. Contact the admin about this update in Telegram group. 3. Auto panel setting. Add an email template. To send delivery emails to your customers, you must upload your delivery email template, trial email template, and renewal email template. Trial and renewal email template can be uploaded later, but you must upload the delivery email template now. If you still don't have email templates, get the template files from the site admin and customize them per your brand. 3.1. Create and edit email template. Let's discuss merge tags. Merge tags are the unique strings in email content. For example, if a string is written as dollar sign underscore username, it will be replaced with the customer's username automatically when you send a delivery email. Check other merge tags examples below. 1. Merge tags for delivery trial email template. Dollar sign underscore username. Replace with your customer account username. Dollar sign underscore password. Replace with your customer account password. Dollar sign underscore expiry date. Replace with your customer account expiry date. Merge tags for the renew email template. Dollar sign underscore order underscore no. Replace with the order number. Dollar sign underscore server underscore name. Replace with your brand server name. Dollar sign underscore month. Replace with order months. Dollar sign underscore connection. Replace with order connections. Dollar sign underscore expiry date. Replace with the order expiry date. So, the customer's order information will replace these merge tags. If you want to add other merge tags, contact admin. 3.2. How to upload email template on AutoPanel. Go to Settings slash Delivery Templates, click the plus button. Input each field. Template name, solver host. Server, solver host. Tick the box to choose account type, trial, active, or tested. Write the title of your email. For example, here is a service delivery order. Upload your template file. Click Add Template button. Repeat the process to add other delivery email templates. Click Dashboard to return to home. 4. WordPress Product slash Attribute slash Variation Setting 4.1. How to add attributes. Add months and connections attributes as IPTV streaming accounts has these attributes. Follow these steps to gift specific characteristics to your products. Go to WordPress slash Products slash Attributes. Type a name in the name field, for example, Connections. You can change the name in any language, but the slug should be the same. Mark Enable Archives to have product archives in your store. Click Add Attribute. Each attribute should have values. For example, Connections attribute can have five values, one connection, two connections, five connections. From now, we are going to add values to connections and months attribute. You can edit, delete, or add attribute values. To add new connections, click Connections, Attribute Name. Enter Number of Connections. You can have one connection, two connections, three connections. Return to the Product Attribute page to add the number of months. Name. Insert the name of the month. For instance, 03 month. Slug. Type the slug name. In this case, 3 month. To find the product variations, return to the product page. Now, you can see various connections and months for the product. 4.2. How to add new product. Go to All Products. Check the list of products. On this page, click Add New. Go to the New window. Insert product name. This should be the same as the server name in the Auto Panel server setting. Confirm again. Scroll to Product Data and select Variable Product. Click Attributes. 
From this drop-down box, choose connections, already defined in the previous step. Click Add. Do the same for Months Attribute. Enable Used for Variations. Click on Values field on the Connection section. Wait until Connections values appear. Select Number of Variations from the drop-down. Go to Months section and click Values. Wait as the month or months loads. Select Months. Click Save Attribute. 4.3. How to add product variations for cost. Go to the Product Edit page again. On Product Data, select Variable Product. Go to Variations. Choose Add Variation. Click Go. Select the number of connections. Choose the number of months. Scroll to the Price field. Insert Price. Click Save Changes. Repeat steps 4 through 10 to add other product variations. Finally, hit Publish to make your product website accessible. 4.4 Test Product Website Type Website URL Click Quick View to check if product attributes are added. Choose a connection and month. Click Add to Cart. Enable the Limit Purchases box if you want users to buy only one item. To see what happens after disabling multiple purchases, go to the product website. Select the number of connections and months. Since there's no option to select the number of orders, click Add to Cart. Congratulations! The last fifth is to contact the panel admin to be tested and approved. If you have questions or issues, contact us ASAP. Thanks for watching our video.